Welcome back to the Blurred Lines of the Brainwash. Uh, hey, this year is going by fast already. It's crazy. Um, make sure you guys file your taxes. <laughs> hey, but um, on the real though, uh, speaking of taxes, uh, let's talk about money today. Um, individual, uh, there's no such... There, yeah, well, I'm not going to get into the individual. Let, let's just go with, there's no such thing as fast money, okay? Um, any, anything that you do that's worth something, you're going to have to put in some work. Without uh, without sacrifice, there's no reward. You have to you have to put the work in. You have to put your work in. If someone came, came up to you and gave you a million dollars, a lot of people's like, oh, sure, I'll take that. But you can watch movies or look through history that typically if something like that happens, somebody is expecting something to receive something. Um, what we like to call in the business world is ROI, return on investment. No one's doing anything for free. Nobody. Nobody. I don't care if you're in a relationship. I don't care what you're doing. I don't care if you're on a team. I don't care if I don't care what you're doing. Everything is a ebb and flow situation. Everything is uh, set up on uh, a give and take relationship. There is nothing in this world that is worth anything where you can sit down and you're behind and just be successful. Because, for example, even gamers, you may be sitting down, but guess what? You're still moving them hands. You're still actually conquering a mission. So there's nothing you're doing where you can just sit down on your behind and do nothing. Nothing. You could be a supermodel sitting down by the pool. But you, you didn't wake up like that. You had to put on some makeup. You had to eat right. You had to work out. The, you, you, every, everything. There, there's nothing. If I'm wrong, please send me, please, please send me something. Like I, I would love to do it because me personally, I'm about to invest in that. Hundred percent, hundred percent. I'm not putting these people on blast that approached me, but hundred percent, hundred percent. You, you got to put in some work. Put the work in. Nothing in life is for free. Nothing in life is for free. You got to put in some type of work. Like you, if you, if it, if it, if you, if it's fast money, then I suggest you do your research. Because it's probably not legal. Probably not legal. Because then that then if that's the case, and you're going into a whole uh, risk over reward type situation. Just because somebody just just because somebody hand out trying to give you something, just somebody put your hand out and try to feed you, don't mean you need to eat it. You don't even know if they wash their hands. COVID. You don't even know if they wash their hands. You better get sick because you over trying to eat off somebody's hand just because they're giving it to you. Some things, uh, if, if it seems too good to be true, you might want to do your research. You might want to do your research. Um, I had to check my notes real quick to see uh, what I want to talk about um, in relation to uh, giving. Because I know that a lot of people's like, hey, um, what about those people that give stuff uh they, that actually trying to bless somebody else. I'm all about that. But that person's character that you go, like you'll be able to tell that person's character. I'm a hundred percent. I'm a giver. I love to give. I get fulfilled by giving. And so that's just me. But I don't mean just roll to me after for $20 because it's just like, you know, I, if I move to give somebody something, it's like, I'm going to give it to you and I'm not asking for anything back. There is no, there's no tie to that because that's just my character. And so I don't have, there's no issue with people. There's no issue with individuals that are giving. There's a lot of uh, philanthropists that go around that, that gives a lot of money away. You know, th th there's nothing wrong with that. I'm just saying, do your research before you just decide to uh, take the briefcase with a bunch of money in it. That's all I'm saying. Like, do, do a little research. Because, you know, people, people give ethically. There's no problem with that. I'm just saying that... Um, all money's not good money. Um, and, um, 
you can find yourself in a whole heap of trouble. Yep, I said heap. Sure did. A whole heap of trouble trying to uh, chase fast money. Whole heap of trouble. Whole heap of trouble. But uh, if I learned that um, if you want to be successful, though, I did learn that uh, this week, you know, I, I was over there ranting and raving because y'all know how I get sometimes. We, we've been doing this for a while now, but for those of y'all that uh, if you follow individuals that are successful, uh, individuals that are successful typically are also good givers. So if you give, if you, if you want to be successful, uh, financially successful, give. You don't have no money, give your time. If you don't have no time, give a gift. If you got neither of those, give some wisdom. Write a note. Give it to somebody. Tell them they're doing a great job. It's just like every, everybody has something to offer. You will not be here if you do not have something to offer to society. You wouldn't. Everybody has something to give. Everybody has something to give. That's why it's good to uh, know your lane. And to stay in it. So you mess around and start changing lanes, guess what? You gonna hit you might accidentally hit somebody cause an accident. Now you're holding up everybody. But uh I'm not gonna harp on this too much, but just know that uh do the work. Stop chasing this fast money. Fast money's not good money all the time. So uh, that's all I got. Feel free to comment, like, and subscribe. Appreciate your support. And once again, if uh you got anything to say that uh, to add on to this, uh, feel free to uh, reach out to me. And I have no problem with addressing that. You know, give me some time to research it. Be, be, give me some time to research it. And I'm all about it. But um, like I said, I appreciate your time. And y'all have a wonderful day. And I'm out.